Disney and Kristen here at the premiere of Adventures in Babysitting, Disney Channel's 100th Disney Channel original movie. Let's see what all the stars at the premiere have to say. How excited are you tonight? I'm so excited. I mean, like, that, that word isn't exciting enough. Um, to see my cast and crew that I've missed for so long and to see this movie that's finally out, but also the 100th decom is crazy. So honored. I'm extremely excited. It's oh, amazing. Is it weird to see your sister in such a, like, rebellious babysitter role when she's so sweet, naturally? It is, because she's, like, the complete opposite. So it's funny to see her. I'm such a nerd. Character. Complete nerd. It's hilarious. And what inspired the goal tonight? Um, just that 100 decoms feels like such a gold moment. I don't know. I just wanted to have fun. So here I am. My dress actually broke a while on my way out. I had to come back to the house and get sewed into the dress. But no one could tell, thankfully. You look fabulous. Rock in the red. You and Sophia match too. I swear to you, I talked to her yesterday and I was like, send me a photo of what you're wearing so we don't wear the same color. And she's been so busy and I was like, I like rolled up and I was like, she's gonna kill me. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I'm so sorry. Did you notice that you and Dove Cameron matched tonight? I did notice, yes, yes, yes. She looks gorgeous. Love the green in your hair. Is it clip-ins or is it your actual hair? No, it's hair extensions. Is it just for tonight or do you do it all the time? Um, I love it. I mean, I wore these for the movie, so I fell in love with it. So I was like, you know what? I want to get hair extensions, so I figured, but why not wear them tonight? What do you think is the key to get this look tonight? Um, I think it takes more work than it looks like it does. <laughs> But I will say it's just about being okay with like a little bit of a messy vibe because I feel like that's always like a really cool look and not not perfection. So that's what I like about it. Which is hard to do, like yeah. perfectly imperfect. Perfectly imperfect, I know, it's so hard. The key to get my look tonight, yeah. um, walking into Top Shop last minute and finding it on the on the rack. So uh, Top Shop is clutch. Exactly. <laughs> Leaving yourself time because I always don't leave myself enough time and I did all my hair and makeup tonight. It looks good. I was relaxed and having someone do it for me. Thank you, by the way. Um, but I left myself literally like three hours so that I had time to walk down to the car and everything and achieve exactly what I wanted. That's always the key. I have some bronzer on, definitely some like lashes kind of give that drama. Um, and I think also with the hair, it's kind of like don't be too picky about it. Like the messier the better. It just seems like it's more textured. So hairspray first and then braid. I kind of went for like princessy this time, you know? Maybe like early Ariana Grande with it, but I don't know, I just wanted to be really girly this time. I like a thick brow. I think a thick brow kind of defines the rest of your face. I didn't figure that out until two years ago, crying forever, because I look back at all my old photos and I'm like, no. So you start back too far, and I just, like, we've all done it. Or you think like that one line is like the best look ever, and then everybody's like, you look so different, you're like, it's my brow. Also, white teeth. I'm an obsessive teeth whitener. I just want to feel my look, whatever I'm in. I mean, going to all these events, seeing all these gorgeous people. If you feel like slightly insecure, your night is off, trust me. So just ending that fits comfortably and compliments you. Is it weird seeing yourself on camera or do you think it'll be fun to watch it tonight? I think it's fun to watch because it's almost not like me because I'm a totally different character. I mean, I'm emo, I'm introverted. I'm not introverted, but my character is so it's like a different person. It's really cool to watch. For more, go to justinemagazine.com. You can follow us on social at Justine Magazine. Make sure you follow us on Snapchat. That's new. And get our issue in print or digitally. It's on the website as well. See you later.